So the Lincoln Park Zoo has been coordinating the Serengeti Health Initiative, which is a program um, that vaccinates domestic dogs for rabies, distemper, and parvovirus, because in Tanzania, domestic dogs are a disease reservoir. So for example, they can transmit the rabies virus to people and therefore are a public health concern. They can also transmit canine distemper, rabies, as well as parvovirus to wildlife such as hyenas, lions, and African wild dogs, and this makes them a conservation concern. And so to mitigate these effects, the Lincoln Park Zoo has been coordinating the Serengeti Health Initiative Program, which vaccinates over 10,000 dogs each year in the villages surrounding Serengeti National Park. These are working dogs, so these dogs lead a very different life from our pampered pooches here in Chicago. Um, they're used for livestock and household protection. And so what they do is they basically roam the household area and keep eye over, um, you know, over the flock and ensure that if any hyenas come in or if any jackals or anything like that, they chase them away. Today we are here because we are vaccinating dogs. After doing the vaccination, we do the questionnaires. So we go house to house asking questions about these rabies cases in humans, rabies cases in wildlife, or rabies cases in, in domestic dogs and cats. The concern was that these vaccinations could impact domestic dog population dynamics, and we may have an overall increase in population um, growth, which would mean that in planning this vac these vaccinations in the future, we may need to plan for more vaccines, more people to go out and vaccinate, more trucks, and so on and so forth. First of all, we haven't had any outbreaks of domestic dog rabies within Serengeti National Park since we began. But something that's been even, you know, equally as wonderful has been that we have not had any human cases of rabies in the villages surrounding the park. And, and obviously that is something, that is an impact that's huge because rabies, um, not only is it just a devastating and horrific disease, um, it's a disease that, you know, can affect especially children because they have the most contact with dogs in these villages.